Hi guys, my name is Teja Swini and welcome or oh welcome back to our sixth session of introduction to Japanese language. For people who've come here for the first time, let me tell you that this is our sixth session. So of course, the first five videos are already up on our channel. We have videos on our channel. So go and so that you understand what's happening. You're in sync with what's happening and you can resume from the sixth video as you're done watching the first five. For people who are back after watching the first five videos, welcome back. I'm so glad you're still here with us and you're enjoying this journey you're having fun aaj hum seekhenge days of the week hai na bahut interesting topic hai uh, bahut hi funny word hai iske liye days ko bolte hai yobi okay so yobi is of course uh, like i mentioned day and of the week to matlab wahi hota hai to jaise um for example hamare idhar sunday monday tuesday bhi se right so sun day to do day aata hai end mein that is yobi okay and then sun man tyu ye jo hai uske liye usko kya bulate hai is what we are going to find out and here is the list of all the words chalo fada fad se jaan lete hai how do you pronounce each word okay here is the english word and here is the japanese words i'm going to tell you the pronunciation you know the drill already i'm going to stop or pause for like two two to three seconds after each word so that you can repeat after me okay so chalo english pehle monday monday ko bolte hai getsu yobi getsu yobi Tuesday, Kayobi, Kayobi. Wednesday, Suiyobi, Suiyobi. Thursday, Mokuyobi, Mokuyobi. Friday, Kinyobi, Kinyobi. Saturday, Doyobi. Doyobi and Sunday Nichiobi Nichiobi my favorite day Nichiobi so baki kuch yaad na rahe aapko rahe ya na rahe Sunday yaad rahe na chahiye what day is today every day is a Sunday for me so Nichiobi is my favorite day uh, but no of course uh, what I want you all to do is in this particular session ye homework hai mein pehle hi bata rahi hu because you are on the slides uh, I want you all to pause the video here I want you all to take a screenshot probably or write this down. And जहाँ पे आप लिखोगे ना वो paper को अपने mirror पे चिपका दो. जहाँ पे आप रोज अपने आप को देखते हो. Mirror is that one place जहाँ पे मैं अपने हर एक every important note, uh, my to do list, whatever it is, I put it on my mirror because I know that's one place where where मतलब जिसके बिना हम जिसको देखे बिना हम घर से बाहर नहीं निकलते. We don't step out of the house unless until we have a look at the mirror. And that's where I keep or I post. A post-it use karti hume, to I post all the important um, stuff or to-do list or whatever. So, a small list bana iska and post it there because it's one of the most, uh, what do you say, important uh, vocab list that you need to remember, you need to learn by heart. And this is if, this is going to happen eventually, okay? This is not an overnight process. I don't want to say that in 6th session or 7th session, you have to get to know all the things you have to know. No. But if you keep practicing this every day, you come to your mom, your father, your brother, your friends, okay? So whenever you meet someone, whenever you are like practicing, you are walking around the house, keep saying, get to know all the things you have to know. Just keep saying. And as soon as, just like Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, we don't even need to think, like, matlab, without even blinking our eyes, we can just tell ki what day is it, yeah. क्या बोलते हैं ऑफ कोर्स व्हाई हैज दिस हैपेंड इयर्स एंड इयर्स ऑफ प्रैक्टिस रोज पढ़ते हैं सुनते हैं है ना तो ऐसे ही लर्न होगा तो मेक श्योर दैट यू बाय हार्ट दिस लिस्ट एंड प्रैक्टिस दीस वर्ड्स एवरी डे अनदर इंपॉर्टेंट लिस्ट इंग्लिश एंड जापानीज अगेन टुडे को बोलते हैं क्यो ऑफ कोर्स अगर हमें जानना है आज कौन सा दिन है तो वी नीड दीस वर्ड्स एज़ वेल सो टुडे इज क्यो टुमारो आशिता ऑल्दो इट्स रिटन एज आशिता ओके अशिता लिखा है बट उसको प्रोनाउंस करते हैं आशिता एंड नॉट अशिता सो टुमारो इज अशिता डे आफ्टर टुमारो इज असत्ते असत्ते यस्टरडे इज किनो किनो डे बिफोर यस्टरडे ओतोतोई ओतोतोई I know it's a cute word, but uh, day before yesterday, who bolte hai? Oto otoi. Okay. 
So now we jump to the main part of asking someone or telling someone what day is it today or tomorrow or whenever. <laughs> Let's step into the question first. Uh, the top line that you see, that's the question. The second line is the question and this is the answer. First line reads, Kyo wa nan yobi desu ka? Okay, kyo ka meaning aapko pata hai, kyo is today. Wa particle, nan yobi, what day? So what day is it today? Kyo wa nan yobi desu ka? Aaj kaun sa din hai? Okay, so today is, jo bhi isme se din hoga. Let's take hypothetically, let's say it's uh, Thursday today. So we say, kyo wa moku yobi desu? Kyo wa, the answer is here. Kyo wa, then you replace it with the day. Moku yo bi des. Okay? Hypothetically, agar aaj Thursday hai. To kaise poochengi kal kaun sa den hai. The second uh, sentence. Ashta wa nan yo bi des ka. What day is it tomorrow? Kal kaun sa den hai. Ashta wa nan yo bi des ka. Okay? Nan yo bi what day? Ashta tomorrow. Kal kaun sa den hai. Again, the answer, kyo ki tarahi answer karenge. Ashta wa. Now, if today is Thursday, kal kya hai? Friday, that is kin yo bi. Ashta wa kin yo bi des. Kal Friday hai. Ashta wa kin yo bi des. Okay? This was very easy. Present tense pe baat kare the. We were talking in present tense. So, uh, nothing basically changes. The, the sentence pattern or the sentence structure is very, very simple. Now, when we're talking about the past tense, this is baki languages mein hota hai na? In English also, we say, what day is it today? What day was it yesterday? Was, hai na? Ko karte hai, hum log is ka was kar, karte hai. Hindi mein if we say, aaj kaun sa din hai? Kal kaun sa din tha? Hai na? We don't say, matlab, Hindi to complex bhaja hai, to kal kaun sa din hai hi hota actually, even if we're talking about uh, tomorrow. But if we're talking about the past, yesterday ki baat kar rahe, so we say kal kaun sa din tha. Hai na? To kal, aaj kaun sa din hai, kal kaun sa din tha. Similarly, now in Japanese, we need to change the tense of the sentence and the question, of course. So, I'm talking about kino and ototoi. Kino is yesterday, ototoi, day before yesterday. Kino, okay, so let's form the uh, uh, the question. The first part remains as is, as uh, apna kyo or ashta ki tarah. But abhi jo end ka part hai, wo dekho. Kino wa nan yo bi, instead of des ka, we say deshta ka, past tense. What day was it yesterday? Kino wa nan yo bi deshta ka, okay? So the answer is, hypothetically, chalo le lete hai, aaj hai Sunday. तो कल कौन सा दिन था सैटरडे किनोवा दो यो भी देशता किनोवा दो यो भी देशता आंसर में भी वैसे ही करेंगे वी डोंट से दिस इन द आंसर इज वेल है ना ये दिन था ओके इट वाज सैटरडे सो इट इज सैटरडे इट वाज सैटरडे व्हाट डे वाज इट यस्टरडे इट वाज सैटरडे राइट सो किनोवा do you be deshta? Same rule applies to ototoi as well. Ototoi wa nan yo bi deshta ka. Day before yesterday. Again, Friday. So, ototoi wa kin yo bi deshta. Parso Friday tha. Okay? Uh, session chota hai, but simple hai, but apko practice karne ki zarurat hai when it comes to forming the sentences. Vocabulary to mene apko bol diya, apko aise ya jayega. Aap agar roz padoge, if you just practice, keep saying the words again and again, if you keep the list in front of you and practice it every day, trust me, you'll get that in no time. But what you need to do is you need to be sure or you need to be a little more careful when you're talking about kino and ototoi. Ki jase present ka past karna hai, deshta ka, deshta, ये चीजें आपको याद रखनी है वंस यू यू नो रिमेंबर इट देन नथिंग स्टॉपिंग यू यू विल मास्टर दिस सब्जेक्ट ओके फॉर होमवर्क व्हाट आई वांट यू ऑल टू डू इज टेक अ स्क्रीनशॉट और पॉज द वीडियो हियर ओके आई वांट यू ऑल टू राइट अ सेंटेंस फॉर ईच हाइलाइटेड टुडे जैसे वेडनेसडे को हाईलाइट किया हमने टुडे सो द फर्स्ट सेंटेंस हैज टू बी टुडे क्यों वा नान यू बी दिस का ओके सो फर्स्ट सेंटेंस वेडनेसडे के लिए होगा क्यों आज कौन सा दिन है एंड देन अमंग्स द अदर फोर दैट इज Uh, ashta, asatte, kino and ototoi. Pick one and write for this day. Then move to the next one. Kyo likhoge aap Thursday ke liye? 
देन अगेन वो वही चारों में से कोई दूसरा लेना है डे किनो या फिर ओतो तो और उसके बारे में लिखना है ठीक है तो ऐसे दो 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 सेंटेंसेस आपको हर एक उड़ी से हर एक डे के लिए लिखने हैं एंड uh, उसका ड्रिल तो आपको पता है होमवर्क का ड्रिल आई थिंक यू ऑल नो बाय नाउ वट आई वॉन्ट यू टू डू इज ट्राई टू फॉर्म टू सेंटेंसेस फॉर ईच ऑफ दीज uh highlighted days and when you write the sentence they have to be written in hiragana of course you can put them in the comment section below and i will cross check and give you give you the feedback okay if you have any doubts if you have any questions make sure that you put them as well in the comment section below like i mentioned every time our number is mentioned here uh, we have our email id mentioned here whatever it is you can write to us or call us any time uh, if you want to inquire about the upcoming batches about uh, you, you want to enroll for the upcoming batches for n5 n4 uh, or whichever batch make sure you give us a call on this number okay hope you all had fun i'm going to see you for the next session which is the seventh session we're almost towards the end of our course. Course, introduction to Japanese. So I'm going to see you uh, for the next session and uh, make sure that you practice the first six sessions really, really well. My name is Tejaswini and I am signing off for today. Hope you had fun.